Makes my heart race. <laughs> Here we go. What's up, everybody? I'm back. Hi, Truman. Welcome, everybody, to season three, kinda, of Sailing the Far Side with the Captain Natalie Myers. All right, so a little bit of background. I've been in Key West the past two years working as a captain um, and creating a name for myself down here. I've been killing it, meeting amazing people along the way, and also developing my skills and confidence as a captain, which you will hopefully see in the next few videos. Hopefully most of you guys know Sasha is currently sailing with Raf on Spirit Animal. Um, I'm going to tag their channel below so you guys can do a little subscription to them as you're following us as well. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this episode. It's a little bit of our preparation for Guatemala. Papa and Mama and I double timed it to get the boat ready in a record time of two days. Anyways guys, here it is, enjoy. Alrighty, hello everybody. So, Kind of exciting news. Papa and I are going to Guatemala. <laughs> We're doing it. We are doing it. Far side needs a little bit of a revamp. She's been uh, sitting here for a little while, but. Uh, yeah, let me just uh, show you kind of what I need to do in the next 24 hours or less. Hopefully less. Definitely less. Uh, <laughs> all right, so. <laughs> clean the bottom. She's been sitting there for two years, so pretty sure new species are happening there. I'll have to collect some data. No, I'm just kidding. All right, so that. Definitely need to scrub the deck first. You can see someone else made its home on the boat. So, gotta do that. We have to add the head sail again. Put that on there. All sails gotta go on. Main sail. Gotta redo our main halyard as well. We still have it cable to rope. So, and it seems to be fraying. So, we're gonna replace that as well. Um... <sighs> Let's see. Yep, here it is. This is what we're going to replace it with. Nice little shackle there. And then... Well, I mean, then just kind of load up some food, load up some stuff. We got approximately a... What, four-day sail to Belize City? Four or five? Four-day sail to Belize City where... The uh, beautiful and wonderful mama will be hopping on the boat for our last leg uh, from Belize City to Livingston, Guatemala, where we're going to be entering the Rio Dulce. Uh, yeah, once we get there, we'll see how that kind of, that'll be an interesting, interesting trip. Apparently, there's a guy you call that uh, hooks up to your main halyard and pulls you sideways if you're, if you draw more than uh, five feet. So we draw six and a half and um, we'll probably have to call him, but we'll, we'll get to that later. We'll get to that later. That's a whole nother part of the story. Uh, but for now, we're just getting her all cleaned up. Everything's stowed away and then we're, we're off. <laughs> Let's go. We're going to <laughs> Yeah, it's not as bad, but where just, is it? just where the two ends come together. That's the critical part. I mean, it's slightly rusted, so it's kind of compromised. Part, yeah, this part stays in the mast, so this never sees the light of day. 
And this part is where it rolls, that goes over the roller. Yeah, that's... And that's pretty... That's pretty that's, bad. That's pretty chafy, so... Yeah, no, so this is good. Good plan, good plan. Out with the old and with the shiny white green new. <laughs> Tape is your friend. Actually, it's Papa's best friend. Um, I think this should be funny. Yeah. Well, if it gets stuck, it's going to get stuck right there. That should work. Oh. Hopefully. Hopefully. It doesn't work. It's got Good time? Yeah. Mm. Got it. All right, everybody, work. <laughs> How did that happen? It was organized. Well, how did this big knot get in I don't know. It must have happened when we were reorganizing. Yeah, secure that over there. So wheat. So this is actually the uh, topping lift that we redid, not the main halyard topping lift. Was struggling a little bit, so. It's early. Okay. All right. Good to go and on to cleaning. All right, this is Papa's special. Uh, you gotta cut this rope. That's what it is. <laughs> it's all we have. It's gonna Man, be a while. That is some high tech technology right there. Yeah, look we, at that. Look, we're getting it. We're getting it. It's only been four hours. <laughs> Got three to go. <laughs> I think these are from a good 20 we're years there. ago, maybe. Look, look. Look, we got it, we got it, we got it. I know, I know we're gonna get it, just, oh, come on, come on, come on baby, it. come on baby, come on. Da, 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 da. Aye. Right, let me bring it through and I'll, I'll, Looks I'll burn the end, okay? So, after we installed the new topping lift, we got a special delivery to our front door and this would be 150 gallons of diesel fuel. They took a truck from the road, ran a hose all the way to the back, and we were able to take off our, our inspection cover. Um, our fuel tanks have an inspection cover so that we are able to put our entire arm inside and scoop out the gunk that we uh, develop and kind of accumulate over the years and months of using it, which made getting fuel delivered that much faster. They were able to pump 150 gallons in less than I want to say like five, 10 minutes, which was probably their quickest fuel delivery in a while. Anyways, here it is.
guess who's getting take so Now we're That's good. good. Okay, go. Do you want me to? Oh, yeah. Wow, look at that. We don't mess around, man. Yeah, you don't get any better than that, Yeah, it doesn't hurt. Well, I could turn it up even faster. <laughs> Probably could, yeah. I mean, that's no, going no, really fast. Holy cow. Yeah. How much is it? I don't know. You want me to shut it off for 150? Uh, or, no, no, we'll shut it off. Okay, whatever you want. What's that? You say that's a suction cover there? Yeah. Boy, that's nice. Yeah, that's the... We got all the guns the other day. You know, the, all these tanks over the years, they get gunk in them, you know, especially when they're... Oh, the black algae. Yeah, the algae stuff, that's yeah. Four, yeah. I mean, had half a bucket of sludge come out of there. Oh, my God. Yeah, if you, can't, if you can't get, if you can't get a... You'll be there forever and clean your filters now. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's why I went through three sets of filter. I guess I said, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, this is perfect. So fast. Guys, yeah, quick trip today. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no one might have known. Just, okay, just, uh, just uh, paradise fuel, yeah. A lot of paradise fuel. Only in paradise. <laughs> <laughs> paradise fuel. And Marco? You're yeah. Out of Marco? Yeah. We're You're good. only Marco, right? Or you go, go, uh, we um we actually go up to Naples once a week. Oh, okay. I have I have deliveries up there, you know, Wednesday. That's, that's it. it. That's it. Okay. Thank you. Okay, good. Bye. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh. Well, One hundred and fifty. <laughs> All right. So I just spent a good hour and a half cleaning the far side luckily it was not like it was when we left on our trip last time because then it was absolutely disgusting but luckily it is clean 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 got everything kind of stowed away and organized except for the nap station but we'll we'll get to that in a little bit um I am about to fix the mainsail. Lazy Jack is actually one little piece of fabric off, so I gotta fix that now. Um, I'm going to put the stay sail on. I'll go outside and show you all of that. and so on and so forth, and then put it in that bag. So main sail is done. However, the head sail is a two person job for sure. <clears throat> Unless your papa, he can do anything by himself. <laughs> but um, yep, we're gonna do the head sail. So here we go. Peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> we did good, we did good. Alright, so the topping lift is on, decks are clean. I'm about to get in the water and um 
Yeah, I'm so excited. This is gonna be so much fun. I may have to take a few breaks, but we'll see. Gotta love krill in the ears, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so this is about to be my least favorite part of anything to do with getting the boat ready, AKA scraping the bottom. I'm gonna be using a hookah hose. Luckily I have my good old Picasso wetsuit with the full face facial covering so that no curl get in my ears and my hair. <laughs> Cause that has to be the worst part. Anyways, here we go. Let's do it. Okay. Let's go everybody. See if I can get this thing on. fashion uh these are our penetrator fins that we got a few years back still to this day the best fins i've ever used love them and they may be scratched up but they're still pretty <laughs> Gloves. This says my whole body's covered. I don't think it's covered. <laughs> They're always won't catch you. They might. Breathe. Pretty sure there's a Loch Ness monster down here, <laughs> and it ain't me. Yeah, yeah, but he's sleeping. He's sleeping. Oh, I can feel them. Oh. Oh. You see all the shrimpies? 
Oh, yeah, I see it. Okay. Oh. Yeah, they're all alive. Look. Look, oh, they move. Yeah. Okay, Natalie, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I'm just so oh, disgusted. Oh, yeah, they are moving I'm all disgusted. over. Disgusting. Oh, they're getting up in your. Mama, oh, don't say go. that. Stop. They got up in your face. Your face. Yes, they are all in your face. Mama. Go in the pool. You're terrible. Papa goes right in the suit in the pool. Come on, go. Help the filter me. will get him. Go. What? Take your suit off in the pool. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Much better. I don't think I can get in the water with <laughs> Much better. There you are. All right. Disgusting. All right. Just go like little worms. All righty. So we finally get to load up the new AB onto the boat. What's great about this thing is that we won't have our gas line in our way because it runs up the inside and comes with handy dandy gas tank. What's nice too is that we finally don't have a broken transom. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, probably one of the most uh, exciting things is that we finally get to take her out. It's been a while. We uh, unfortunately had to put a pause on all our fun little new toys that we received, but it's time. Okay. Man, oh man. Dollies are my best friend right now. Oh, Dolly. All right, Mama, let's see it. What happened? Right here. Oh, Mama hit a bush. Mama hit a dead bush. Natalie. What? Don't forget, we have to change the propane tank. Change propane tank. We got a fresh one over there. I was thinking that while I was cleaning the uh, oven. It's alright though, it's in the water. Need some new rope, 
That's how you do it. Stay tuned to see us in action. Right, Papa? <laughs> right. <laughs> Thanks, AB. You're the best. So, it's the day we leave. We made a quick trip to Costco, got most of what we needed, and put it on the boat. Did some last minute cleaning and then it was time for us to really prepare to go. Now, you guys will notice a little bit of sound issues. That is because my smart head um, decided to not realize that I was taking slow-mo videos on the GoPro. So I had to speed them up and fix the sound a little bit in order to get the videos back to how they were before. Anyways, if you guys noticed that, that's what it is. Bear with me. It'll only hopefully be for the next episode and the end of this one. But hey, we all make mistakes. I'm a little rusty, but I'll get there and we'll get you guys some great content. All right, today is the day. I woke up at about 6.30 this morning before my alarm. I was so excited. And because Luca woke me up at 3 a.m. to go pee, of course. I know it's not the reason he woke me up, but it's all right. Tossing and turning, I was so excited. The boat is ready, almost. I packed up all of our provisions. Uh, cold and dry stuff. Lots of snacky poos. Um, still have a couple things to put away. Have to hang up our fall weather gear and wetsuits. Hello, mama. Hello. Have to make the V-birth. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm putting some medication away. We have so much. We don't need all of that. Alright, fine. We need all of it. Alright, so, Mom and Papa's bed needs to be made, but all of our dive gear. Spinnaker sale. We have our nice new refrigerator. We're going to be adding that to the other side so that we can get colder over there. Our magma grill. Some fabric. We're gonna probably be getting nice window covers. You can see out, but not in. Um, it'll keep it cooler in here, so we have those. But, yeah, so Mama and I just need to go do a little bit of shopping. And then hopefully by then the tide is up and we can get out of here. All right, stay tuned. Last little bit of provisioning and getting ready, but we're almost there! We're a little bit behind schedule. We kind of wanted to leave by 11, 12, but close enough. Mama, what are you doing with those? I mean, go sit here and see if you like it. Mama. Hey, but I just want to wonder. 
Pillows? We don't need any more pillows. Maybe those gray ones, not that one. It doesn't, it's not two, just two. Matching pillow. That one's ripped. Look, why? This one's, look, this one's ripped. Well, you, there's, it doesn't matter. You just put it on the bottom. Ugh. To see if it, if it, okay, well, works. here, look, I don't need this. There's no room for it. Right. <sighs> Mothers, right? Love them. Last stop. Almost. Hopefully. Go. Oh. Looking good, far side. Looking good. Alrighty guys, that is it. That is all of our preparation before we leave. Stay tuned for the next video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Please leave comments and critiques if you have them and uh, we'll get the next video up as soon as possible. Special thank you to all of our patrons and all of our sponsors who stuck with us through thick and thin and over the past couple years. That's a wrap. And uh, again guys, it's Captain Natalie from Sailing the Far Side. Let's go.